Jacob McIntosh here at uh, Lazy L Lake with Team Fish Fighters. We were out here for about 24 hours now, caught, caught a decent amount of fish. Quite a few commons, lots of buffs and grassies. Uh, Zachary ended up with a 22.4, I think. Big, nice, nice grassy. We are out here carp fishing. That's a passion. Been carp fishing for about, about two and a half years now, about a year for European style carp fishing. We're out here getting it. Hey carp anglers, my name is James Sanders. I'm from Team Fish Fighters. Today's show, George Bird is going to be doing a little demonstration of what kind of bait he used at Lazy L. Check it out and thanks for watching. Hey, I'm George Baird from Team Fish Fighters. Here to give you a little demonstration of what we was using here at Lazy L. Catching some good clean buffs, grasses, and commons. It's just a little thing that I do on the baits that I use at this time of the year that work really well with me. For, for one, I use the banana WCB oats, which you can get at Westside Bait and Tackle. I also use R&W Red Honeysuckle, which you can get at Westside Bait and Tackle and also at Indy Lakes. And it will take a can of cream corn to get this all together. What I'll do now is I'll mix the batch to show you guys what I do to get it all. First off, I'm going to cut off in my bag, maybe. Add the whole bag of oats. Take my cream corn. I'll put in just about a quarter of it. Then what I'll do is I'll take some of my R&W and I'll just pour a cap full. Add it in with the rest of the cream corn. And this is why my scissors don't work if you need to know. Stir it up some. Get it all nice and mixed up. Pour the rest in. Make sure you get it all out. And just mix it up real good. Make sure you mix it nice and good. If not, you will have some dry spots. You'll have spots that will work good and pack right, then you'll have places of it that's not going to sit in right. If you mix it all up pretty well like that, get it all situated. Let it sit about five minutes. It'll be really good and go to pack. First, it's going to be wet. Let it sit. It'll dry out very quick. Get everything situated. Hope you guys get some tips and help in this demonstration. I want to thank Westside Bait and Tackle and Indy Lakes being sponsorships and helping us get where we're going. I hope you guys enjoy. Thank you. Carp anglers, I hope you enjoyed that little demonstration. Here are some of the highlights for today's show. Thanks for watching. Yeah. Fish on. Fish on. Yep. Got a net out of here? No. Uh huh? Oh, he's riding in the trees. Hey, Zach! Ooh, it looks decent too. You got a net with you, Jane? Huh? You're over that line. Yeah. Uh, yeah, but I need to put it together. Grab the net. Yeah, he's wrapped up in this one. I'm trying to keep it down. So. Oh, she's over in this one. Oh, she's coming back. Oh, she ran into the branch of this one. That's what it was. 
Excuse me. Yeah, you're all the way up in this one, James. I'm trying to. You're all right. I'm trying to keep it away. I'm fighting with you. Because <laughs> it ran this one. Yeah, thank you. I suppose you come up. I'll, I'll work Look, with you. He's just yeah. over it. You threw it. Flip your. You take this rod, the rod you got in your hand. This one needs to go over. Go yep. over. Now you're out. Oh, thanks. Come on, bud. Give him a little slack. We got another dolphin. Wrapped up on the tip there. Your line's wrapped up on the tip and probably pull it down. There you go. Sweet. I did it again. Might need a little slack. It's a round tip again. Does it? Yeah. There you go. Got the baby in the background. James Sanders with the buff. Looks like a nice one too. Not too bad. George Bird. Tinsley.
That's pretty good buff. So decent. You see him upside down? Second buff ever right there. Good job. See, it's heavy. Is it heavy? Looks like a solid little fish. Cradle. That's what's in the grass, he's right there. Oh, yeah. Good hook. Yeah, that's probably good. What, 13 pounds, George? What do you feel like? Yeah, he's about, about 10. You think? Yeah. He looks pretty thick. He's a good fighter, I know. Eric Tinsley. Ooh, that's a decent one. That is a decent one. Is that grassy? Nice. Awesome. Weigh that one up. Yeah. You got scales with you? I said I got mine over in the truck. I got them. I got right. There goes the beat up. One thing about grassies, they like to beat, beat each other, beat themselves up.
think as much energy as they had oh my gosh on the mat that they'd fight a lot more mm -hmm. in the water they just don't stop I think I tell you the cool thing about grass is their torpedo body. Yeah. They're built for speed. Yeah. Anybody got something I can open this with? Off. <laughs> <laughs> and that fish had my line underneath my pod. I mean, he smacked the hell out of it. I mean, hard. We're there, buddy. We're ready. All right, let's zero this out. guesses real quick. Uh, I'm gonna say 17. 15, 17 or, yeah 18-2, You want to get, want to get a quick picture with you holding it? 18-3. Long yeah, that's just like the one we got. But I think the water one is right here. Uh, when it's in my bag, and it's there, it's got the going on. So. I like that waist sling. That's a nice little chum sling. See the scales he just popped off? Mm-hmm. Missing spots. Her so pretty. Alright. Here comes the plug part. 